okay. yeah the question was um what's the biggest fear now you know um you said back then the biggest fear is people might find that world fake but fake yeah right now third book what is your biggest fear my biggest fear right now is not enough people will get to read it or not enough people will read it okay i want this story see fear comes from uh, your um, uh, desire the acute desire and that that whole thing that your expectations won't be met or this is what stems uh, in this in this case so uh, because it is my deep desire that i want this story to reach out to as many people um, uh, as possible because like i told you i am very it's very close to my heart it's, I, i think it's very emotional and also i feel that um, why i want people to read durga's journeys because um, it is um, you know it's it's an it's a you know how the character is she's gone through all these emotions and relationships so i just feel that lots of people will find some uh, resonance or the other either in emotion or a situation or uh, and I, i want them to experience that so i really really hope that this book reaches out to as many people as possible and uh, my biggest fear right now would be not having as many readers as as i would want for this particular story right okay indian writing you know uh, it's going places a lot many writers these days so what do you think of the current situation is it a great time to be a author for a first time for first timers or is the competition way too much right now to even get published you know i think i think it's a, it's a good time i think it's a great time uh, not only just uh, being an author but i think we are a young country right now and um, uh, and we are in a very beautiful phase uh, of uh, creative expression in every field we have youngsters taking very um, uh, like there was a point where people would only do be an engineer doctor ias but now you know world is a platter and you you can uh, go and um, you know dream of anything and go and get that so uh, coming particularly to the publishing industry um i'd say that's a very good time because uh, not only um, like you said the market has exploded there's also another po- reason that that's happened is because in india uh, compared to the western world we have more first time readers coming in mm. because uh, there the markets to some extent are exhausted right. here we have uh, we have um, an opportunity to draw in more people to reading they, they could be reading uh, they could they could read ebooks or they could read uh, paperbacks that's right. a different question altogether but first time re- uh, drawing in first time readers is a is a good uh, it makes a good business sense uh, and makes uh, sense for the, from the marketing perspective etc etc so the market conditions i feel are such that new authors uh, indian writers very good time and um, also i feel that uh, uh, you know the publishing industry is taking indian authors a little more seriously than they were before so it's the factors are it's very conducive environment the factors uh, are all coming together for a good platform for authors so i would really encourage anyone out there who's thinking of leaving their corporate jobs <laughs> and wanting to write a book um, you know you can you can you should go for it right Now you're also working a lot of scripts uh, and you're married to Prakash uh, who himself is a very I don't know how to put it because he writes so much right yeah. so what are your conversations like at home uh, do you keep discussing a lot of stories well um, our conversations range <laughs> from uh, definitely stories and characters but we have a regular conversation about food and going out and uh, movies and uh, we have a lot of arguments healthy arguments about about, about uh, our, our take on a movie which ah, we okay. really enjoy ah, there's nothing uh, fishy <laughs> there huh? i know you're fishing i'm not but, fishing uh, for anything <laughs> but uh, but actually i really enjoy those healthy discussions that we have and we we like to uh, you know discuss a lot of things yes a lot of our conversation is centered on uh, is centered around uh, films stories books but you know that's the life we chose and that's what we love so um yeah so if you were to put a bug in a room uh, you would get a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of ideas a lot of ideas and a lot of characters and a lot of uh, you know discussions 
and uh, yeah uh, is your idea of life very different from where it comes from or are you two on the same page in terms of what you talk about or what you think about it will be so boring if we are both on the same page there will be no conversation only he will be like oh i think the blue is good i'll say yeah and that's it so no i thankfully we have we are we are uh, different enough um, and um, um, to have a, a good conversation or debate or discussion uh, i have my set of um, you know likes and dislikes he has his own and uh, a lot of times we don't see eye to eye which i think is very good and healthy